Let's go over measuring a reamer in a Parlec ER Kala chuck. Like always, make sure the taper is as clean as possible. Once we know that it's clean, we can put it into our spindle. Let's inspect the cutting edges using the surface light inspection. For better clarity, we can always toggle the illumination. Once we ensured our cutting edges are acceptable, we can focus one of the cutting edges using the focus gauge. Initiate the spindle brake lock to ensure the tool does not move. While we're at it, we're also going to clean the edges with a piece of masking tape or putty to make sure we don't pick up any dirt or debris. Now we're going to select the geometry mode. And as you can see, the z-axis crosshair has automatically picked the tool surface for the length. So we could just freeze that value. Now we want to measure the actual reamer diameter, not the tool diameter including the tool runout. To do this, we're going to select incremental mode on the x-axis and radius mode so we can get a linear measurement. Now we can move the machine's x-axis to the opposite side of the tool. Release the spindle brake lock so we can refocus the back side of the cutting edge. We can now see the actual diameter of the reamer in real time on the Axis Digital Readout. Let's print a label and now this tool is ready to go. This concludes the origin training video. You can refer to the operation manual for more information on measuring and inspecting tools. And from all of us here at Parlec, we would like to thank you for purchasing your Origin Presetter. And don't forget to keep us in mind for all of your high precision tool holding, boring, tapping, and presetting needs.